This is the day the Lord has made. This is indeed the week that the Lord has made. As you know, every single Monday morning, we come in guns blazing. We come in guns blazing. This is the day. Good morning, Miss M. I see you had a good week. Thank you so much for the gifts. Amen and amen. Can somebody tell somebody in the comments section, show me your power. Hallelujah. This morning, I thought we we're going to start this week by asking God to showcase his power. Hallelujah. We are going to ask ask God to showcase his power. Father, anoint my lips, anoint everything that is in me in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let everything that I am and that I have praise you, God. Let every voice that proceeds from my mouth be a blessing to somebody this morning. Let it be a life-changing word. Every single prayer, every declaration, every decree that we are going to say with our mouth is going to be a life-changing uh, prayer in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Bible says, that says the Lord, the Holy One of Israel and his maker, ask me of the things, ask me of the things to come concerning my sons and concerning the works of my hands. Yea, me. Hallelujah. Ask me for the things that are concerning to come. Hallelujah. So this morning, as we are declaring and we're saying, Lord, show me your power. We are saying, God, show us the things that are to come. And the Bible says, and it shall come to pass before they call, I will answer while they are speaking i will hear come on somebody hallelujah do you know that you serve a god that will answer your prayer a lord a lord that says i will answer before you call hallelujah while you are yet speaking i will hear so the lord has got our audience this morning in the mighty name of jesus christ i want you to tap on that screen like crazy hallelujah the lord is going to show us his power as we begin to command this week in the name of jesus christ when you are commanding it means that you are ex exercising authority over something talk to me somebody when you are commanding that means you are directing something i want you to direct the affairs of your life this morning i want you to direct the affairs of your life this week the affairs of your family the affairs of your career the affairs of your family directed with authority talk to me somebody you are the manager in charge you are the ceo that is in charge tell, tell your neighbor show me your power lord show me your power lord. the lord is gonna showcase his power Power, as you engage and engage authoritatively in the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord is going to show you the full scale of authority that you have determined and purpose in your heart. He's going to lead you down the path of huge success in the name of Jesus Christ. Talk to me, somebody. Come on, somebody. You are the one that is in charge of set, uh, setting up exactly how you want to manage your business, how you want to manage your family, how you want to manage your ministry, anything concerning you. Hallelujah. Every child of God has a glorious and enviable destiny in Christ Jesus. Talk to me, somebody. And, a, and as such, such a destiny as a believer must shine brighter and brighter until the day of Christ coming. Talk to me, somebody. Are we tracking together this morning? Talk to me. Believers have been given authority. When I say believers, I'm talking about me and you. Yes, Anna. Talk to me, somebody. Tell, tell your neighbor, the Lord is going to show off his power this week. Hallelujah. This week, you are a show off for Jesus. Talk to me, somebody. You have authority to speak to this week. You have authority to speak to this month. Hallelujah. He says believers have been given the authority to command their days, their weeks, and their months every day. Hallelujah. To showcase the power of God. To ensure that your life yields an increase. Talk to me, somebody. You have the authority this morning. I hope you came in guns blazing knowing that you have the authority. Talk to me. Hallelujah. We are going to command the week with the expectations that we are expectant of. We are going to instruct and command every single element of the week to cooperate with us every single element of nature the sun the moon the stars everything that the lord has created it is going to bring actualized fruits to for us hallelujah we are going to be fruitful can somebody tell somebody i am fruitful this week i am productive this week hallelujah we are going to issue declarations our declarations will be accompanied by our faith our heart will show forth our rights in redemption he's died for a reason he was nailed to the cross for a reason he was nailed 
nailed on that cross because he wanted to showcase that we have the rights in redemption. Talk to me, somebody. We know our rights in the name of Jesus. The Bible says, let us come boldly to the throne of grace uh, before it, anything that the devil could ever plan, before the devil can try to dislodge anything, before the devil can try to lie to us and tell us that God does not love us or God has not forgiven us about anything. God says, you can come boldly to the throne of grace uh, knowing that I have forgiven you, knowing that you have you, you whatever repentance that you have already come with, I have forgiven you. I have taken you back. You are my own. I created you. Talk to me. Show forth your power, oh God. We come this morning to speak the right words as believers, oh God, because we know that our our words and our tongues, oh God, they carry life, oh God. Therefore, we speak life into this week in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, as we open up our mouth this week, we open up our mouth, Lord, declaring that you are going to fill them with laughter. You are going to fill them with results. You are going to fill them with evidence in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So begin to open up your mouth and declare to the Lord and say, I am fruitful. I am productive. I am charging into this week. The Lord is going to showcase his power in me. The Lord is going to show. When somebody showcases, that means you are there to show off. You are there to show everybody that this thing is happening. This thing is not fake. This thing is original. Talk to me. Hallelujah. Let the Holy Spirit fill your mouth this morning. Let the Holy Spirit fill your mouth with the words that you need to send forth in the spirit realm. Let the Holy Spirit fill your mouth with the things that you need to say, uh, uh, you know, into the physical realm in Jesus' mighty name. Remember, a closed mouth is a closed destiny. Oh, thank you, Jesus. My mouth shall not be closed this morning. My mouth shall open up and the Lord shall fill it with the words that are full of life. My mouth shall produce fruitfulness. My mouth shall produce prosperity. My mouth shall produce success in the name of Jesus Christ. Mm. My destiny shall manifest because my mouth is open. My destiny helpers are hearing me right now because my mouth is open in the name of Jesus Christ. Before we call, he will answer. Before we are, while we are yet speaking, he will hear. Hallelujah. What an assurance of faith that we have in him. Hallelujah. All we need is to decrease and declare in faith and we, he will make sure that he increases us. Hallelujah. When you decrease, you are humbling yourself and you say, Lord, increase in me. Fill me up for this week in the name of Jesus Christ. And so shall it be in the name of Jesus Christ. The words of life, the words of triumph, the words of victory, hallelujah, shall increase in my life. Talk to me in Jesus' mighty name. Somebody begin to declare with me and begin to pray along with me. Make sure you are shouting that amen louder. Talk to me somebody. It shall be accomplished the things you could not accomplish in the past week. In this week you shall accomplish and beyond in the name of Jesus Christ. I see the week producing the best results for you in the mighty name of Jesus. God is going to produce the best results for you in the name of Jesus Christ. God is going to produce the best results for you in this rest of the month of June in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, we thank you. Holy Spirit, we thank you. The Bible says in Revelations 22, 2, when you are trekking with us, there's a tree that, that, that there's a tree that, that bears 12 manners of fruit and the leaves are for the healing of the nations. I don't know what, what kind of tree that you need to bear this morning, but the Lord is saying there is healing for the nations on the tree that I am clinging to this morning. I am clinging to the tree and the vine of life. I am bearing fruit. I am fruitful. Talk to me, somebody. I am bearing the healing of the nations. I am bearing my own healing. I'm bearing the healing of my family. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I am a believer. I am meant to receive at least one new thing from the Lord every week, every month, every day. I am receiving fresh benefits loaded. Come on, somebody, talk to me. I am a believer. I am receiving a new thing this morning. I am receiving a new week as I start this month in the name in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Begin to command what you want to see in the month of June. Begin what to command what you want to see in the month of, uh, of June and in the week, uh, this, this week of the fifth, uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, if you believe it and you say it, you will get it. Hallelujah. You will only get it if you believe it. I see people in the comment section says, I am believe I am bearing healing for my family in the mighty name of Jesus. As you declare it in the comment section, so shall you have it in the name of Jesus. As you command these words, they go forth into your month of June. They are established into the month of June. They are established into this week. You are going to see an elevation and acceleration that starts from this week to manifest the words that you are typing in that comment section. 
talk to me somebody i see it you are bringing fruits and benefits through the fruits and benefits are being burst forth in you in the name of jesus christ you are bearing fruits and benefits that your house will not be able to contain in the name of jesus christ somebody say increase somebody say expansion somebody say expansion somebody say increase hallelujah do you understand that you are bursting forth at the seams the bible says that when jesus came on the boat of the fishermen they said we had told all night and we did not catch anything and he said if you believe in me and if you can say it with your mouth if i can come into you boat and you invite me this morning and you just launch out into the deep the very same deep that you say you have been on the whole day the whole night i want you to go back in there and the Bible says, uh, the Lord said, put out your nets again, uh, throw them again. I don't care how many times you say you have tried for the rest of the year, since the start of the year. I want you to throw out your nets again, uh, throw them into the deep again. Uh, and the Bible says that they caught an enormous amount of fish. The, the, the Bible says, describes it in this way. Uh, the illustration says that, that the, the, the nets began to burst. Hallelujah. So I see the Lord uh, bringing net breaking blessings. Uh, that was blessings that were overflowing that could not be contained by the nets. Talk to me, somebody. Oh, Karaba I declare, I decree, and I declare that the net-breaking blessings are coming in your portion in wonders that you have never seen. Eye has not heard. Eye has not seen. Ear has not heard. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I speak grace and life into your month. I speak grace and life into your week. I speak fruitfulness into your month. I speak fruitfulness into your week. I speak net-breaking blessings net overflowing blessings there is no room enough to contain it i don't know whether you are staying in a one bedroom house and two bedroom house i don't know whether you are believing god for a double story or a single story but the lord says do not limit me the lord says the sky is not your limit you need to see the net breaking advancement the net breaking expansion and extension hallelujah so hakariyama the house will not contain it that means even your heart your own heart in your your heart in your believing heart you will not be able to contain when you see the evidence and the fruits of the lord talk to me somebody is somebody ready to command showcase your power this morning oh god somebody needs to declare it in the comment section showcase your power lord showcase your power lord showcase your power in the mighty name of jesus christ as you pray this morning as you believe god this morning as you believe god this week hallelujah you are going to receive a better week you are receiving a better month in the mighty name of jesus christ the power of god is available he's going to showcase your his power oh god your power is available to cause this month to bear fruits for us in the name of jesus christ this week shall bear fruits for us in the name of jesus christ this day shall bear fruits for us in the name of jesus christ father we decree and we declare we shall never be thrown away we shall never be downgraded this month in the name of jesus is there somebody who believes god this morning mm. Somebody keep on commenting in that comment section. Showcase your power for everyone who asks receives. Uh, and he who seeks finds. Uh, him who knocks, uh, he, the door will be open. Talk to me. He who, who asks receives. Uh, I don't know why people are not asking. What are you waiting for? Because the Lord says my presence is already here. My Holy Spirit is already here. My angels are already here. They are waiting to execute. Uh, he who asks receives. Uh, if you are quiet with your, with your asking, you will not get any answers your closed mouth is a closed destiny somebody shout to your neighbor open your mouth open your mouth he who asks receives he who seeks finds i don't know what you are looking for this morning i don't know what you wake up to look for this morning but he who knocks will receive and the knock if you knock on that door the door will be open but if you are sitting there timidly and and you are just being cozy about it you are being cute about it and you are knocking or not knocking on any door there's no door that will be open tell your neighbor knock on that door knock on that door open that mouth and ask something from the lord open that mouth and ask something go out and seek what you need what you need is also looking for you what you are looking for is looking for you then make sure that there is a mating season that comes what you are looking for is ready to mate with you what you are looking for you what you are looking for is already ready to be intimate with you tell you that that neighbor if that neighbor is still sleeping slap them and tap them on their back 
like. Make sure you take them and tell them, open your mouth. Ask the Lord, knock on that door. Ask the Lord, knock on that door. Talk to me. Oh Lord, I thank you. I praise you for the covenant of blessings that you have upon us, your children, oh God. As we rose this morning to declare upon this week and upon this month, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we thank you, Lord. We receive the covenant of blessings and we receive the covenant of peace in the name of Jesus Christ. We thank you, Lord. We move with the shalom of God. Peace is with us. Peace is with our family. Peace is with every decision that we'll take in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, let your covenant be reinforced this week. Let your covenant of divinity be reinforced this week. Let your covenant of peace be reinforced this week. Let the covenant of the blood of Jesus be reinforced in this week for us in the name of Jesus Christ. For the mountains may move and the hills will disappear, but even my faithful love for you will remain. Ah, Kayaba Sonda. Is somebody hearing the prophetic word this morning? The Lord says in Isaiah 54 verse 10, I should confirm to somebody who woke up this morning. He says the mountains can move, the hills can disappear, but my faithfulness and my love for you will remain. Somebody needs to know that when you were rejected and when you were dejected, when they told you that they are serving you with those divorce papers, when they told you that they were serving you with those resignation papers or whatever, the firing papers, whatever they call it, when they served you with that rejected letter that your application has not been removed, the Lord says, tell them to calm down fortune that I am embracing them. Tell them my love is remaining. My faithfulness is still there with them in the name of Jesus Christ. June is carrying my faithfulness. June is carrying my love for them. My covenant of blessing will never be broken, says the Lord who has mercy on you. He says my covenant of blessing. When he says the covenant of blessing, you need to understand that the blessing carries so much. The blessing is not just the car. The blessing is not just the house. But it is an empowerment. An empowerment that expands in every area. An empowerment that expands in every area and everything that you are asking God for this morning. It is an empowerment to be healed. Is it an empowerment for prosperity? It is an, an, an all-round holistic empowerment. Somebody received the covenant of blessing this morning. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. When you check with the word of God, it takes you to the book of Proverbs chapter 10 verse 6. And the Bible says blessings are on the head of the righteous. But violence covers the mouth of the wicked. Mm. If the mouth of the wicked is covered, kalabashonda by violence, I need to understand that when I see blessings happening, then I understand that the righteousness of God. Then this morning I rise to declare again, Lord, I'm the righteousness of God. You redeemed me to become, make me righteous. I am in right standing with you. I don't care what the devil says. I am not the wicked of the Lord. Therefore, any violent attack on my life, any violent attack from any violent altar has no effect on my life. I'm the righteousness of God. The covenant of blessing is in operation in my life. Am I communicating to somebody this morning? Is somebody shouting this louder to the... Showcase your power. Tell your neighbor, showcase your power. Showcase your power. This week you will receive access to spiritual gates. I command spiritual gates to open for you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I command the portals of divine wisdom to open for you you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ you need to understand that you are not just an ordinary being you are above even an alien you need to understand that you have portals that you are stepping into and you are stepping into the portals of wisdom you are stepping in port when you are stepping into portals that means you are not going step by step is somebody catching this in the spirit you are not moving at a step by step pace you are not moving at a snail pace this means you are moving at the speed of light talk to me you are moving at the speed of light, your wisdom at the speed of light, your business at the speed of light, your education, your academics at the speed of light, your decision making at the speed of light. Somebody receive your access to the portals of wisdom. You are receiving the portals of grace and favor. They are totally open for you. I wish you could type that amen better than I'm speaking. In the name of Jesus, I wish you could tap on that screen. Talk to me, somebody. I receive creative energy. Somebody declare it there. Receive creative energy energy from the Lord. The Lord will give you a solution. The Lord will show you Casey, what you need to achieve and how you need to do certain things where you have been stuck, where you don't know what is the solution to the projects that you have been doing in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Receive inspiration. Receive in innovation. You are going through the portal of innovation. You are going through the portal of inspiration. God is giving you ideas in all that you do. You will not fail. You will succeed. Receive. I'm going through the portals of inspiration. 
innovation. Somebody declare it. I'm going through the portals of innovation with speed. I'm going through the portals of God-given ideas. My God-given ideas are good ideas. There is no way they can fail. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh, Rabbi Shikonda, I stand in the word of God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Rako Soto Koliyama Sondaria Masanda. Blessed and happy. Karoshe Kete Kila Basoto Koliye Meshe. Resi Kola Masete Kida Bashete Kelie. Raso Koliyama Sanda. Proverbs 8 verse 34 says, Blessed and happy. Fortunate is that person to be envied. That means you are blessed. Not only are you empowered, but you are, you are fortunate to be envied is the man who listens to me. Watching daily at my gate. Waiting at the post of my door. Do you understand that what you are doing today is a prophetic word? You are doing the fulfillment of the scripture. That you are waiting daily at 5 a.m. On this altar of protocol breaking prayers. You are saved. The Lord is saying you are blessed. You are empowered. You are the fortunate one that people will envy you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. He says those who listen to my word. Who hearken to my word. Who hear and do my word. Who are watching daily at my gates. Do you understand that when you chose to wake up and you chose that I will be present this morning, you are watching, you are daily at the gates of God. This is a gate. This is a portal in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. He says, waiting at the post of my doors. Do you understand that this is the door that you have come to? This is the door. This is the door. This is the door. This is the door. This is the door that you need to knock on and this door shall open in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Jesus, I wish somebody could tell, tell somebody that showcase your power Jesus showcase your power God in the name of Jesus but now not in the wisdom of this age not in the wisdom of this age or for the rulers of the age who are coming to nothing no we declare God's wisdom and mystery that has been hidden that God destined for our glory before time began do you understand that he has declared before time began he has made sure that the mystery that lies in his wisdom is being revealed to you this morning talk to me somebody do not miss your prophetic word this morning. Somebody shout, showcase your power, Jesus. Showcase your power, Lord. Oh, Lord, let your divine wisdom bring me into supernatural, abundant life this, this week in the name of Jesus. Come on, pray along with me. Pray along, declare it. Open your mouth. A closed mouth is a closed destiny. If they don't ask fortune, they cannot receive. If they do not knock, they cannot get the door to be open. Knock on that door and declare it right now your divine wisdom oh god is bringing me into supernatural abundance your divine wisdom oh god is bringing me into a week full of favor this month of june shall be full of favor in the name of jesus christ proverbs 8 verse 35 says for whoever finds me finds wisdom if you find wisdom you find god if you find wisdom the bible says you will find life and you will draw forth and obtain favor for the lord do you understand the effects and the and the power of the portal of wisdom that he has sent me to generate for you this morning? He says, fortune, open up this portal of wisdom so that they understand that when they get that wisdom, they get the life that they need. They will draw forth and they will obtain favor with me. I am drawing forth. Yes, oh God, I'm stepping forth into the door of wisdom. I am stepping forth into the portal of wisdom. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I declare that favor is coming from the north, the east, the west, and the south. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I declare that wisdom is overflowing all around in me. In Jesus' mighty name, I declare that my family shall not falter and they shall not fail. They will operate in the same dimension and beyond on the dimensions of wisdom. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, thou has granted me in life an abundant life. You have granted me favor, oh God. In the name of Jesus Christ, your visitation has preserved my spirit. Somebody was about to burn out. Somebody was about to give up. Somebody was about to check out. Somebody was about to commit suicide. And the Lord says, no, 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 no. Thy visitation, the visitations of God have, have restored your spirit. Your spirit man is restored, is preserved. Your life has been preserved this morning. You did not come on this broadcast by mistake. Oh, Kalesh can you say it again for me and say showcase your power lord showcase your power lord somebody is being healed on your neck in the name of jesus i command that pain to leave you right now in the mighty name of jesus christ mm. 
my god my father my father i decree and i declare that insecurity any form of insecurity that anybody came carrying this morning anybody who was feeling insecure anybody who was feeling fearful that fear has no place in your life insecurity has no place in your life in the name of jesus christ i decree that this is the week of your favor in the name of jesus christ you are in the right camp you are in god's camp when you're in god's camp there's only favor that is operational in the name of jesus christ in the camp of the god of the Lord. We are working with only honey and milk. Talk to me, somebody. You are restored. Shalati in the mighty name of Jesus. When she saw him, she was greatly troubled and disturbed and confused at what he said and kept revolving in her mind what such a greeting might mean. And the angel said to her, do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found grace. When the angel visited Mary and Mary was told you are going to bear a child and and Mary said, how is it possible? I have not slept with a man. How am I going to be pregnant if I have not lost my virginity yet? He says, don't be confused. Do not fear. The Lord is about to overwhelm you, overlap you, overshadow you, everything concerning you. He's about to infuse himself in everything that you are. He says, do not be afraid, Mary. You have found grace. When he said, you have found grace, I would tap into that anointing. What he was saying, he was saying, Mary, he was saying, me and you who's hearing the sound of my voice, we have found grace. We have found spontaneous favor. We have found absolute favor. We have found the loving kindness of the Lord. Mm. If I look at it, Isaiah 41 10, he says, Don't be afraid because I am with you. I don't know who you have been waiting to join your camp, but the Lord says, Do not be afraid. I am with you. For as long as God is with you, that is the only team that you need. Talk to me, somebody. He says, Do not be intimidated. I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will support you. I will be, I will make sure that you are victorious. I will support you with my victorious right hand. Is somebody seeing the victorious hand of God right now this morning? Somebody needs to see the victorious hand of God this morning. He says, I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will strengthen you with my victorious right hand. Somebody shout it again. Showcase your power, oh God. Showcase your power, oh God. In the name of Jesus, I block and reverse every satanic error. I reverse any fiery dart that has been released against you in the name of Jesus Christ. Anything that has been released your way, that has been saying that you will not expand, you will not expand in this season. Anything that has been saying you will not move forward in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I block it, I reverse it, I annihilate it, I obliterate it, I, I squash it, I burn it in the name of Jesus Christ by the fire of the Holy Ghost. It catches fire right now. Somebody shout it again. Shout it again. Showcase your power Lord. Showcase your power Lord. Showcase your power Lord. Showcase your power, Lord. Genesis chapter 49 tells me that Joseph is a fruitful bow. He's a fruitful bow by a well. His branches run over the world. Do you understand what the Lord is saying to you this morning by planting the scripture right now in us right now? He's saying you are a fruitful bow. Your branch run over the world. The archers have bitterly grieved him, shot at him and hated him, but his bow remained in strength and arms in hands. Oh, the arms of his hands were made strong by the hands of the mighty God of Jacob. Joseph was, was reinforced. He remained a fruitful bow. It doesn't matter how they try to short circuit you. It doesn't matter how they want to slow you down. You remain a fruitful bow. Your bow will remain in strength. Your, the arms of your hands will remain strong in the hands of the mighty God of Jacob. In the name of G J Jesus Christ. Sonda, there is a shepherd. There is a stone of Israel that is speaking for you. There is evidence. We have evidence. We have evidence. Somebody shout it out loud. Somebody shout it out loud. Showcase your power. This is the week. This is June. This is the month. This is the week. This is the month. In the name of Jesus, above all, taking the shield of faith with which you will be able to quench all fiery darts of the wicked one. Father, in the name of Jesus, we rise to declare all fiery darts are being quenched right now. Every single fiery dart is being quenched 
baptized right now in the name of De- Jesus Christ. I decree and I declare and we establish that this week is the week of unexpected blessings. This week is a week of unexpected unexpected breakthroughs. This week is a week of unexpected blessings. Testimonies, unexpected testimonies manifest yourself right now in the name of Jesus Christ. This is the week of unexpected testimonies. Showcase your power, Lord. Isaiah 64 says, you have done amazing things. We did not expect. You have done amazing things. Isaiah 64, 3 says, we did not have an expectation. You read it in the Amplified. It amplifies itself. You see, it says, we, it, it is beyond our expectation, even what we were thinking. I am a God that does far above, beyond all things that you could ever imagine. Your mind cannot even contain, cannot fathom. You cannot even formulate in your mind the things that I'm about to do in this week and beyond. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus Christ, you came down and the mountains trembled before you. Do you understand? Understand that there is a God that has come down this morning. Every one of your mountains is trembling now. In the name of Jesus Christ. He said to the prophet Habakkuk, he says, I will do something in your lifetime. Hallelujah. Habakkuk chapter 1 verse 5. Habakkuk chapter 1 verse 5, he says, I will do something in your lifetime that you will not believe. Even when you are told about it, God is going to do something so wondrous in your life that you yourself will not believe it. Come on, somebody. Showcase your power, Lord. Showcase your power, Lord. Showcase your power. Is somebody communicating with me this morning? How are we doing for time? Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I see it, Lord. Showcase your power. Showcase your power showcase your power mara official are we showcasing the power fortune L online are we showcasing the power in the mighty name of jesus showcase your power lord showcase your power lord father my father this week we shall be satisfied no poverty in the body of christ no poverty of soul no poverty of body no poverty of spirit oh lord in the name of jesus christ this june month this june week oh god the anointing of god on us oh god shall manifest shall give us favor in the the name of Jesus Christ. Mm. I declare and I declare this week you will not labor in vain. You will not plant and another will eat by your hand. By your hand, your labors of your hand, you shall eat from the fruits thereof. Whatever you sow with your hands, you shall eat the fruits thereof. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree and I declare everybody who's at the sound of my voice, right now the Lord will make you a winner in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You are a candidate of uncommon testimonies in the name of Jesus Christ. As you shout that, amen well. As you shout that, amen well as you shout that amen well as you shout that showcase your power very well this week is your week you are a candidate of uncommon testimonies lily thank you so much god bless you in the mighty name of jesus christ i declare uncommon testimonies i decree uncommon uncommon expectations and uncommon breakthroughs your way in the mighty name of jesus christ this month father we receive daily every single day of this month our daily bread oh god we receive good seed to sow every time in the name of Jesus Christ, uh, we receive the money to spend always that will load us with daily benefits, Father God. We experience no lack in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody shout it out loud. Showcase your power, oh God. This week and this month, oh God, manifest your power, oh God. Manifest your power, oh God. In the name of Jesus Christ, uh, Father God, advertise your glory in my life. Uh, advertise your glory in our lives. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ, uh, the Lord is going to advertise his glory in your life. The people of the nations shall see the glory shine upon you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My God, my God, my Father, my Father, cancel any appointment with sorrow. Cancel any appointment with tragedy. Cancel any appointment with evil cries in the name of Jesus Christ. This month we cancel any appointment with death. We cancel any appointment with sorrow. We cancel any appointment with tragedy. It is not our portion in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. This week and in this month, uh, we will encounter and experience full-scale laughter. Somebody begin to laugh in that comment section. Say, aha, 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 aha. He who sits in heaven laughs. Hallelujah. Aha, aha. I am laughing at the devil. I'm sitting on the head of the devil. I'm in charge. I will receive laughter in this week in the mighty name of Jesus. Showcase your power, oh God. I will receive the full scale and extent of laughter in all my endeavors in the name of Jesus. Whatever I lay my 
thy hands on shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus Christ uh, this week and ma- and this whole of this month. Uh, any bloodthirsty demons, any bloodthirsty robbers uh, will flee at your presence uh, in the name of Jesus. When they see us, those bloodthirsty demons and devils, uh, they will not stand our side. They will have to flee. Somebody shout, aha, uh-huh, aha. Uh-huh. Shout aha uh-huh, aha. Uh-huh. I want to see you laugh. I want to see you laugh. I said type aha aha. Aha aha. It's better than an emoji. I want you to say it again. Say it again. Aha uh-huh, aha. Uh-huh. Father, anything that I have waited for until this moment from Ma- from January until June, right now, it shall be miraculously delivered. It is your portion in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Wherever you are on whatever sea you are, whatever air you are are on whatever road you are any evil force that is trying to 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 block you right now it gives way in the name of jesus i say every evil force every evil power any evil roadblock it bows to your authority in the name of jesus christ aha 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 i see mara official you are laughing louder in the name of jesus as you laugh louder the lord shall increase you and expand you in the mighty name of jesus talk to me somebody Father, I decree and I declare that myself and my family, my members, hallelujah, they are completely immune to sickness. They are completely immune to diseases. Those who have woken up, who are partners of this ministry, those of you who are diligent, who are seeking the Lord's face, who are here with us on this protocol breaking prayer every single day, and those of you who are new on this broadcast, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree and I declare immunity from sickness and disease. This is not the week you will fall sick, you will not receive bad news in the name of Jesus. Aha, aha. Koraba shokotia masonda. In this month, in this week, lokoria masonda dia masanda. I decree that you are under the protection of the Lord. The arm of the Lord has covered you in the name of Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus has covered you. You are protected. Shout, I'm protected. I am protected in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. This month, Karaba shokotia masanda. This month of June, in the name of Jesus. I am untouchable. I am unstoppable. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, let your will be done. In this week and beyond, you will serve the Lord. You will unlock the blessings of the Lord through your service in the name of Jesus Christ. This is your week of reward. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you will have unconquerable victory. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every enemy that comes your way, you will receive victory over them in the name of Jesus Christ. Like a clay in the potter's hands. The Lord will make what you want out of your life. Whatever he has proposed to make out of you, it will be done in the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord is, is molding you and the Lord is remolding you. Wherever there are cracks, the Lord is saying, I am remolding you. I am making you into what I created you to be in the name of Jesus Christ. I want you to be glorified through me. That is what the Lord says. This week, the Lord will make you the head and not the tail. He will make sure that you are above and not beneath. The Lord says every snare, every snare of the enemy, every trap of the fowler that has been assigned against you, every snare of the enemy, every trap of the fowler that has been assigned against your career, it will not stand in this month of June. It will not stand in this week of June. It will not stand in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We render the habitation of darkness against us right now. Let it be disobedient in the name of Jesus. You will not find yourself in dark places in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Am I communicating to somebody? Somebody shout it out louder. Oh, showcase your power. Showcase your power. Father, my father, in the name of Jesus Christ, any place of darkness where my family has been assigned to, right now, I render that place in desolate. It's desolate. It's empty. It shall never be occupied. My family shall not be in desolate places. My family shall not be in barren places. My family shall not be in the wilderness in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, deposit those things that will make me do exploits. Settle me in this month of June. Settle me in this week of June. In the name of Jesus Christ, let me be settled. I will do exploits in this week. In the name of Jesus, as I enter into the covenant of blessing, I enter into the covenant of favor. In the name of Jesus Christ, in this week and beyond, in the whole month of June and beyond, I enter into the covenant of favor in the name of Jesus Christ. 
I decree fruitfulness is coming your way. In the name of Jesus Christ, you are a candidate for fruitfulness. Whatever you lay your hands on shall prosper. In the name of Jesus Christ, any obstacle on the way of progress in your life, it is dismantled now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The Lord says, arise and scalaba shokodia. I have arisen and I have made sure that the light has come to light up your dark places. In the name of Jesus Christ, kariaba sonda, your destiny shall be fulfilled. In the name of Jesus Christ, oh God, my Father, my Father, arise and scatter every evil pursuer of our lives. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord is arising and scattering every pursuer of your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, those that have decided to mock you in the past, hallelujah, shall celebrate with you in this week. Those that have been mocking you, that have been looking at you and saying you have never invited them for a celebration, get ready to send out those celebration invitations. In the name of Jesus, my Father, my Father, Father, I speak this mantra. Any Goliath, any Haman that has been assigned in my life shall experience destruction. Come on, make sure you are declaring it. Open your mouth. He who asks receives. He who knocks, the door opens. He who karaba shokon yamasonda. Every Goliath in your life, every Haman in your life shall experience destruction in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every Haman in your life begin to be destroyed. Destroy yourself in the name of Jesus Christ. Every power that has been assigned to cut short your life it will die in your stead in the name of Jesus Christ your prayers will provoke angelic intervention your prayers will provoke angelic violence in the name of Jesus Christ I speak words over you that will bring testimonies in the mighty name of Jesus Christ the fruits of your life for this week and this month shall be released right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ you will continually stay in the secret place you will abide under the shadow of his wings I decree and declare that you are protected in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I give, the Lord will give angels charge over you to keep you in the name of Jesus Christ. In all your ways, you you are protected in the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord is sending you right words to speak throughout this week and throughout the month of June. You will speak the right words uh, to break every barrier that has been set up against you. No barrier has been is big enough uh, to bring you down in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Sharon, I bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, I break every single barrier in your way in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, may you succeed. The glory of the Lord shall be seen on you in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we decree and we declare that the plans of the enemy the devices of the wicked against us and against our life uh, shall be disappointed the plans of the wicked against our destinies shall be disappointed in the name of Jesus Christ father we thank you for answered prayer in this morning in the name of Jesus Christ we thank you for your mighty hand is upon us in the mighty name of Jesus Christ and the saints of God shouted a believing amen shout that amen if you believe it shout that amen if you want to seal it shout that amen if you want to make sure that this detail Declarations have reached heaven. Shout that amen louder when you want to know that the angels are busy executing. Right now they are discharging. They are out. They are saying we are out on assignment. Our shift has started in Jesus' mighty name. As you type that amen well. 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 Go, go, God bless you. Bongiwe. God will showcase his power this week in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus mighty name. We place a demand on the blessings of God. The covenant of blessings is activated on you in the name of Jesus Christ. Showcase your power oh God. Showcase your power oh God. In Jesus mighty name. Sharon God is showcasing his power on you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I speak increase. I speak favor in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. God abashu showcase your power oh God we stand on the scriptures as declared and decreed we stand on the prophetic word as it has gone forth in the mighty name of Jesus Christ you cannot be hindered and you cannot be delayed Matthew you cannot be hindered you cannot be delayed Pindile you cannot be hindered you cannot be delayed in the mighty name of Jesus Irene you cannot be delayed I said God showcase your power in Lungis's life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ begin to declare it begin to declare it right now. Showcase your power, oh God. Showcase your power. Nobantu, showcase your power, oh God, on Nobantu's life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree and I declare, Olive, the Lord shall showcase his power. The Lord is faithful to meet you at the point of your need. Yes, it is true indeed. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, there is no other Jesus Christ except the one we are praying to. He is the only one from Nazareth. Make sure you are praying to the right one. I like that comment. Rakosa. 
Mataka lia makoda Rashiko lia masonda kila brasonda Mlungi sikali ya masonde Kele beshiko rabaha Zaka dada The Lord will showcase his power Kari ya masonda Kepi the Lord will showcase his power Keep on declaring Kara basheke lia Rasoto kodi ya basanda You are a child of God You are born of the spirit You are redeemed by the blood of Jesus One that the Lord will showcase his power in your life In the name of Jesus Christ Bongi where the Lord will showcase his power in your life Gundo the Lord will show pay, showcase your his power in your life this is the time come on karo kola basonda i don't know whether you are requesting or you are declaring make sure that you are speaking open your mouth he who asks receives he who knocks the door shall be open if you don't ask you don't receive when you have asked and you have received you declare thanksgiving you begin to thank him now thank you so much father thank you lord bongiwe shall not be hindered in the name of jesus christ your path is straightened out in the name of jesus christ Masiho, the Lord is going to perfect that which is concerning you in the name of Jesus Christ. Karoba shukodia masotaka. Showcase your power, O oh God, in the lives of Sharon showcase your power in Mr. Rye's life. Caroline, the Lord is going to showcase his power in your life. Megan, the Lord is going to showcase his power. You will walk in authority. You will walk in authority in the name of Jesus Christ. All authority has been given to you. Not only are you a water bearer, but you are bearing the waters of living water. Those living waters right now, they are being discharged to every area in your life that has been dry up until now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And Tami wonder Nkonaiza. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I declare increase and expansion in your projects. In the name of Jesus Christ, I declare that you will break forth in your dreams. In the name of Jesus Christ, Shala Kadia Masoko Takadia Masonda Ikalaba Soto Korea Basanda. The Lord will showcase His power. The Lord will showcase His power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Dumiza, the Lord will showcase His power in your life. In the name of Jesus Christ, Bushale Petsi. In the name name of Jesus. Petsy, in the name of Jesus, he will showcase his power. This is your week and beyond. Somlanda, the Lord will showcase his power. Anaga Bengele, the Lord will showcase his power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, I thank you for these ones that have woken up this morning in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. As we close the broadcast, Father God, they go out, they are charging forth. Father God, they are more than conquerors, oh God. Father, they will experience the fullness of the covenant of blessings. They will experience the fullness of the covenant of favor in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I cover them with the blood of Jesus Christ and they are putting on the whole armor of God. Nothing shall by any means harm them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I decree upon their lives, Lord, that they will walk in the authority. They will live a life without apology because your power shall be showcased in their life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I come against any principality, any power that is trying to wrestle with you and, and, and wrestle with you in your prayers. Right now in the name of Jesus Christ, it is bound in in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we arrest every single principality, every power that is trying to bind you, that is trying to cast you down. You will be lifted up. Every step forth that you take is a step up. You will take a step. Every step that you take, any portal that you enter of wisdom will take you to the next level. You are going up in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we come against the rulers of darkness of this world, against the spiritual wickedness in high places. We arrest them right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you, Lord, that none shall be weak, none shall be weary in the name of Jesus. We will not get tired. Instead, it is the devil that will get tired in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Any wandering spirit, any wandering destruction, we arrest you today by the power of the living God. In the name of Jesus Christ, you will not be wandering. You will not be confused in Jesus' mighty name. The anointing will that you carry this week is the anointing that will enable you to pray and read the word and meditate. You will get results to your prayers in the name of Jesus Christ. You cannot be hindered. You cannot be delayed in Jesus' mighty name. Father, the, op the heavens are open for them in the name of Jesus Christ. We baptize them with the Holy Ghost right now. Right now, go out and conquer in the name of Jesus Christ. The heavens are open for you in Jesus' mighty name. Angels on assignment have been discharged in the name of Jesus Christ. Your prayers in the whole of this week, they will attract track divine intervention in the name of Jesus Christ. Every situation in your life, every sign and wonder that you have been waiting for, every prayer, every testimony, every evidence is released now in Jesus' name. May your name be glorified in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. 
amen and amen thank you so much guys for joining thank you for those i um on facebook and on youtube if you manage to at least hear the voice i pray you did otherwise we will put the audio on youtube uh, shortly after this in jesus name um please make sure you are following the accounts that you are watching from if you are on tiktok you click on that top account and you click follow if you are on Mara official and you're wondering which one is my account it's fortune l online i will try and make sure that i put it up for you as well just shortly so make sure that you follow that account and do yourself a favor you click on that profile picture and you come out in there's a little profile at the bottom you you see the youtube link make sure you follow the youtube link so that you can always go back and re-watch and replay anna bless you you can go and watch and re the replay of it hallelujah remember wednesday evening 7 p.m wednesday evening 7 p.m i think we, we said we're gonna have our zoom workshop on finances okay thank you so much guys thank you so much for those of you who are always praying for me thank you lord thank you thank you thank you lord thank you for these intercessors that you have given me that are amazing thank you for those that have joined my team there that have sent me those hearts those big hearts i don't know what you call them thank you for those who have who are considering partnering thank you so much guys um Oh, thank you so much, guys. Um, oh, some Lander, God bless you. Thank you so much for the feedback. Oh, guys, um, Bri um, Beatrix, Beatrix had a baby. Um, Apostle told me I missed it on inbox. Apparently, she did re respond back. Apostle, did you determine the, the 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 gender of the baby? But let's pray for her. She's a new mom. She delivered very well. Remember, we were on the broadcast and she was in the labor room and she was watching these prayers. So Beatrix made it awesome. Um, you are healed in Jesus' name, Sharon. We are praying for you guys. Can we spread out our love towards Sharon? Make sure that you are sending. Sharon is S-H-A-R-E-N. Let's all pray for Sharon. Let's just you know, lift her up in prayer. Father, we decree and we declare that Sharon is healed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we command your healing angels to work on her, to perfect her and to give her strength in Jesus' mighty name. By the stripes of the Lord Jesus Christ, she is healed in Jesus' mighty name. I tell you, Shalati Sophie, we give birth while we are on prayer here. While we are still praying, we were we were helping somebody give birth right in the um in the in the delivery room. Hallelujah. Yeah, there's Sharon, guys. Make sure you tag her and you just pray for her. Tag her and follow her. Pray for her. Sharon, we are waiting for that testimony. I know you'll be strengthened by the end of today. You will already be feeling something awesome. Hallelujah. You will be feeling strengthened in your body. Amen, somebody. Amen. Let's all pray. We are praying for Sharon right now, guys. Sharon, the, the healing is the children's bread. You are commanded to be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. We speak to that illness. There is no illness that we speak to that illness. There is no illness that is above the name of Jesus Christ. We decree and we declare that in the name of Jesus, you are healed. In the name of Jesus, you are healed. Also, another people, there's more than 60 people praying for you on Marwa Official currently right now. Sharon, I hope you are feeling the strength and the power of this altar. People are praying for you. You are healed. It's declared. Receive it in Jesus' mighty name. You are going to be so strong. You're going to come back with a testimony in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Divine healing upon you. Lelo Savior. Healing, healing all around. Healing all around in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord is your healer. Ah, karaba soto kodi be sheketi ya masota la kasata kadi ya basoto kodi ya basande kila brako soto rejege de gila basonda i kalabra sonda di ya basonda father thank you we said with two or three, I get that you are in our midst, oh God. By the stripes of Jesus, we decree healing, Lord. Right now, in this anointing, in this presence, right where you are right now, in Jesus' mighty name, we decree by the stripes of Jesus, she is healed. Lord, you took away her sickness in the name of Jesus Christ. You carried our pains on that cross. Lord, this morning, we decree and we declare that you are carrying away the pains of Sharon right now. Anybody who is also ill in your body right now, I want you to 
to lay hands on that part of your body that is sick right now in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I break it right now. I break that infirmity in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Lay hands on any part of your body right now where you are feeling pain, where you have been having any chronic pain, any, any form of discomfort, any pain right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, I thank you. I break that infirmity right now in the name of Jesus Christ. It is the will of God that you are healed in Jesus' mighty name. I speak to that pain on the left hand side. You've got a pain on your knee in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I speak to every form of sickness. I speak to that leg. I come in the name of Jesus Christ. I command cancer to leave your body right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I command lupus to leave your body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every hidden sickness, I command that high blood pressure to be normalized in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Kalaba soko tekida by asanda. I command that pain to leave your body right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Leave that body in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I speak to every form of infection that is in your body right now. I command it to leave. Come out in the name of Jesus. I speak to anybody, whatever infection, wherever it is right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I command it to come out in the name of Jesus. I release the miracles of our healing God in the name of Jesus. He is a healer. He is the divine healer. He is the doctor of everything. Health and healing has come your way right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I command diabetes in the name of Jesus. I command diabetes to leave your body right now. I command a complete restoration in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Any form, whether it is hereditary, whatever it is in gene, some of you have you have inherited these diseases right now. I come against the spirit of hereditary diseases in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Tibos, 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 Calabra, Soto Kone Meshekita, La Kosoto Korea, Masonda, Kadia Basonda. I command that diabetes come out in the name of Jesus. Come out in the name of Jesus Christ. Kalama Soto Kodi Emeshi. E Kalama Soto Kodi Amasete. I command every gem, every sickness, whatever it is, whatever you are redeemed from sickness in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Loose that infirmity. Be loosed in the name of Jesus. Be loosed in the name of Jesus. Be loosed in the name of Jesus. Kosha kata kadia masoto kodia. Rakasata kalaba soto kodi ebeshikota kadia basete. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Kalaba soto kodia masanda. Male, I decree and I declare as you have come on this broadcast, kalaba shonda. Make sure you follow me and you go to the to 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 join the YouTube and watch the videos that I've been speaking over the past few months. Hallelujah. Especially the month of May, you will receive complete turnaround of mindset. I have no doubt in the name of jesus christ i command you will be unstuck in the name of jesus christ father i decree and i declare male you are unstuck in the name of jesus christ my heart say you are blessed may you see the power of the lord in the name of jesus christ lord the lord says i've given you strength over any sickness i have given you authority against anything that may harm you in the name of jesus christ the lord is giving you strength and the lord is giving you healing right Right now in the name of Jesus Christ, Karaba Shekelia Masoto. Hey, Karaba Sheke Tekida Basonda Kalabra Kote Kia Masi La Kosondo Kida Bashende Kida Bayesi Kalabra Sonda in due time. This is your due time for healing. This is your due time in the name of Jesus. This is your due time for healing. Somebody receive your healing right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Machuka Tepo, receive the divine intervention of the Lord and your divine answers that you have been waiting for in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I pray for Boateng right now. I decree and I declare that you are healed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus, may you receive the power and God showcases power in your life in Jesus' mighty name. I command healing right now in your body, right now in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I pray for every single child that is sitting for exams right now. Father, I come against any evil power that will try 
interrupt any child of God, any of our seeds, oh God. They shall write exams. They shall not be distracted. They shall not be hindered. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, any evil manipulation, I squash you right now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, somebody is being healed of the back pain right now or your lower back pain by your, uh, your waist here. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, we thank you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Guys, don't forget to also show up on Wednesday, 7 p.m. for the Zoom. I will put up the link. I will make a video or I will put up a poster on, on my Fortune Online and we will also put it up on Amara Official. We need to attack this issue of uh, financial lack in terms of jobs in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we give you all the praise. You are Alpha and Omega. We declare, Lord, that you are the one who heals all of us in Jesus mighty name we come boldly to the throne of grace oh God that we may obtain mercy and we may obtain healing also God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ father we declare be Rafa in our life he is Jehovah Rafa and father thank you every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God right now we command it to be removed and to be cast into the sea in the mighty name of Jesus Christ as I'm praying for those who need physical healing I need you to tap into that and you pray for that same healing because finance also can also be diseased. So as I'm pray, pl praying for physical healing, I'm also praying for that financial healing. Oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, every mountain, it is removed by the power of the Holy Spirit right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We speak a holistic anointing of healing in the name of Jesus Christ. We command all sickness and all diseases to be removed, to be cast into the sea. We command all pain to leave our bodies right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We speak to that constipation. We speak to that pain. I command that constipation to lift from you right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I declare healing. I declare healing right now in Jesus' mighty name. Zimkita, you are blessed in Jesus' name. I declare healing. I decree healing. Let your healing touch, touch them, O oh God. Touch us, O oh God. Touch us, O oh God. Touch us, O oh God. In the name of Jesus Christ. Teta, you are blessed. In the name of Jesus Christ. Kenya, Kenyan, Babi, you are blessed. In the name of Jesus Christ. May your finances receive healing in Jesus' name. Zimgita, may your finances receive healing. May you experience the speed of light in your finances. The speed of light that will turn around your finances like never before in the name of Jesus Christ. Miriam Langa, you are blessed beyond measure. May the Lord showcase his power in your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Doreen Zulu, may the Lord showcase his power in your life in this week in Jesus' mighty name. He was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement for our peace was upon him. And by his stripes, we were healed. And Lord, we stand by those stripes. We are declaring and decreeing that we are healed in Jesus' name. Baba B, you are healed in Jesus' mighty name. Teta, you are healed in you fulfilled destiny in Jesus' mighty name. Receive it now in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we continue to trust and have faith in the power that you have brought for us, Lord. You said you came to mend the broken hearts. You came to heal those who are diseased, oh God. Right now, we receive it right now in Jesus' mighty name. Kenyan Babi, I command that acceptance letter to come through in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Mr. Rai, I have prayed for you and I pray for you again. May the Lord meet you at the point of your need and grant you your heart's desires in the mighty name of Jesus Christ as you continue. Continue to align yourself with the will of God. May the Lord expedite that which you are believing him for in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I wish above all things that you prosper and be in good health. It is the desire of the Lord that he wants you to prosper and be in good health. Stand on that word in Jesus' mighty name. The Lord desires your prosperity and your good health and your divinity. That is why I say we are praying along the finances and the health. Guys, Guys, let's meet tomorrow 5 a.m. again uh, South African Standard Time. Make sure you are if you are only jumping in now it's 6 10 my place so it means 10 at f f 1 hour 10 minutes ago that's when we started make sure you join us at 10 p.m. we are back on the same platforms we are doing in-depth teaching of the word make sure you bring your pens and everything and your and your journals and everything but please do me a favor join the channel where you're on right now before I switch off um Miriam, your husband will come out of intensive care in Jesus' mighty name. We thank you, Lord, that there shall not be any complications. We thank the Lord that he will be given strength and be and, and be strengthened, that he will fight. Hallelujah. Herbert, God bless you. Thank you so much. So as we go off right now, guys, make sure you follow the platform you are in. Make sure you are here again, 5 a.m. in the morning. 
5 a.m. is not for the faint-hearted. It's for, for warriors who are fighting, who are saying we deserve a better life. So make sure you are here. Make sure you have followed the channel you are in. Make sure you are back here 5 a.m. tomorrow morning. Make sure you are here at 10 p.m. God bless you. I love you so much. Have a beautiful, 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 beautiful day. Have a beautiful week. Have an awesome week. Go out and conquer. You've got this. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Our official, thank you so much. Um... Lebo, may God bless your hubby as he's going for that job interview. May he have all the answers as they ask him. Let the Holy Spirit speak through him in Jesus' mighty name. Hold hands with him and pray with him before he goes out and tell him he's got this, okay? He's got this in Jesus' name. Amen. Love you guys. Thank you so much.